what is going on ladies and gentlemen welcome back to another video in this one you join me inside the extra 200 I'm just strapping myself in here ready for some aerobatics uh, and whilst we're flying around here I'm just going to give you a little overview as to what we're doing today uh, this is going to be my first introduction to tail slides uh, this is not what you're seeing at the moment by the way um, that will be coming uh, in a little bit I just thought I'd give you a little rundown as to what uh, tail slides are and uh, why they're actually pretty dangerous probably the most dangerous maneuver uh, in the whole aerobatics uh, competition uh, figures simply because they can cause a huge amount of strain and uh, pretty horrendous uh, forces on the uh, controls of the aircraft as, as it uh, slips backwards after it reaches zero airspeed on the vertical line. Um, so if any of you have experienced flight controls being slammed by a gust of wind on the ground, this is pretty much the same effect. Uh, airplanes are really not designed to fly backwards uh, and it does create a huge amount of strain and also requires a fair amount of strength from the pilot to keep the control centered or uh, in the position that you want to have them in. So performing a tail slide essentially what we're going to do is we're going to go into the vertical, nice clean vertical is absolutely essential. Uh, we're going to kill the throttle and uh, that's because uh, the torque of the engine will essentially cause the aircraft or the fuselage to rotate in the opposite direction and at very low airspeed as you might imagine there's just not enough airflow going over the wings and over the ailerons to have any sort of control authority therefore you can have this effect of a torque roll and uh, torque rolls are separate maneuvers however this is not something that we're doing today uh, that is uh, again a little bit advanced and uh, I'm sure I'll get to it at some point but at this point we just want to concentrate on doing clean uh, tail slides. Now tail slides can be performed either canopy up or canopy down so in other words once the aircraft reaches zero airspeed does it fall on its back or uh, you know sort of just erect uh, like uh, like you see here with the sky pointing up the way. In our case we are going to try and uh, make the aircraft uh, flip-flop essentially uh, nose down so canopy up. What you want to do uh, for that to happen is you want to basically cheat a little bit just before you get to zero airspeed. You want to just tip the aircraft one or two degrees nose forward so that it topples over in the correct direction but then also at the same time you need to keep the stick fully aft and that is because the effect of the controls or the elevator is essentially reversed when the aircraft is flying back the way cause the nose to drop uh, and similarly with the rudder pedals you got to be quite careful because once the aircraft is flying backwards with negative airspeed, what actually happens is it's reversed. Left rudder will give you uh, right yaw and uh, right rudder will give you left yaw. So it all gets a little bit confusing. So if you really do want to control the tail slide on the way down, uh, you need to take that into account. Just remember that the rudder has the opposite effect. But ideally, you really want to keep the rudder um, in a sort of locked position because uh, if you don't, uh, there's a huge amount of strain with the wind flying in the you know the wrong direction backwards that can slam them one way or the other to cause some damage to the flight control so you don't want to do that. There we go, so that was uh, a demonstration by my uh, brilliant instructor, Aiden. Uh, so now it's going to be my go, and we'll see how we get on. We have two good engine sides, you're clear to disconnect the headset. We'll see you on the left with the pin, thanks a lot. Oh, okay. 
Alright folks, that is the end of our tail slide sortie. Now we're just doing some barrel rolls basically to get underneath some controlled airspace. Uh, we've got the throttle somewhat open uh, as a preventative measure uh, to prolong the engine life. Basically we don't want to shock the lift, uh, so that's why we need to kill some height with some barrel rolls and some high G maneuvers. Uh, now I do want to apologize about the quality of the audio in this footage with regards to the radios. Um, I have since then eradicated that problem so you won't see it in future videos. Uh, but for now I hope you've enjoyed it anyway. Stick around for the landing and hopefully I'll catch you in the next one. Adios. Let's try that one more time.